on each of these three holes get a heartbreaking roll away or a great tee shot. Oh, no. <laughs> what is this guy even doing? Oh, that's my commentary. <laughs> what is this guy even doing? <laughs> there he is. I think that's the picture used on our McBeast challenge disc. Oh. There it is. <laughs> See, this is where it started. This is where, It's the same shirt. Why are trees? It is time to open up the Jomez Pro Vault. Let's do this. <sighs> we got Paul Macbeth this week. I think he's ready. Where's he at? Paul, what's up? Oh, yes. <laughs> Are you muted? There Are you we good? Go. Okay, he's good. I was, yeah. I'm good. <laughs> How's it going, Paul? Not too bad. I'm uh, happy to be here. I've, uh, I've watched a few episodes, so I look forward to... Um, the nonsense I'm about to get into. <laughs> <laughs> you already know what the vault is about. He's, He's studied. <laughs> we, we put out a call in the comments earlier today, of course, for, for questions that we're going to get to the Q&A here in a little bit. But we were like, you know, what 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 are we going to show Paul? And people were so brutal. I mean, they don't forget. They're remembering stuff that I forgot about. These rounds of just like 2016 this, 2017, you know, <laughs> Utah something. I'm like, Man, you guys are like, it's pretty crazy that people are just like, they, they think they know what the vault is all about, but that's not really what we were intending it to be. It's just like I said before, sometimes people play good, sometimes people play bad, and that's just how it goes. So, and you just happen to pick out all the bad things and showcase it. That's what your job is. But someone's always yeah. playing good as well, right? It's not like I'm just <laughs> picking. We never, where... we never have them as a guest. So <laughs> I think all the people, all the people bringing all those suggestions just shows it really sticks in your mind when this dude misses a putt or two. That's true. Yeah, that's it's very you kinda, out of character. You, you kind of go, wait a second, what's happening? This isn't just your average Sunday. Something's going on. Yeah, we I just, remember. We make, just make a full video of it. Oh, out. I, I, I'll, I'll put I specifically reason. remember you missing a putt in 2014, and I never forgot it. Um, and <laughs> Nicholas Vaughn again. Time, Nicholas Vaughn with another fifty dollars, and your buddy still hasn't showed up. There you go. Wow. <laughs> Thank you, you know Nicholas. What? Thank you very much. Wow. Jeremy, the one putt that sticks in my mind that you missed is the one at uh, at Connecticut. Yes. Yeah, that, that one. Okay, so I'm glad you brought that up because we showed that video to Thomas Gilbert this year, and yeah. his reaction from that video wasn't, "Oh my gosh, how did that putt just weeble wobble out?" It was, "This is a Paul Macbeth video, and I've never seen it before." <laughs> <laughs> that sounds about right. All right, well, let's get in to the Jomez Pro Vault. I know a lot of you are wondering what we're gonna pick. There's a ton of suggestions. And I had to go with the first time that we had Nate Sexton and Paul McBeth together on camera. It's for our cameras. <laughs> and that is the 2015 Hall of Fame Classic at the International Disc Golf Center in Appling, Georgia. We're going to go with round two. Let's get started. We're looking at a good battle so far. We kind of got the show down. Yeah, I just came right out and said Big Sexton commentary. That's what we'll call it. All right, round two, commentary for Hall of Fame Classic. You guys ready? Almost. Let's get ready. Let's do this. All right. I'm ready to do some commentating. Oh, God. What's up, YouTube? This is the Hall of Fame Classic, round two. I'm Paul Macbeth. This is the Sexy Beast Takeover. I'm here with the one and only, the man that is making disc golf sexy again. Nathan Sexy Sexton. <laughs> What's up? Here we go. It's me, Sexy, or as my mom might call me, Nathan. We're ready to get some commentary done. I'm right here next to the one and only McBeast. Turn them speakers up. Let's get it going. It's just no one in the history of commentary has emerged on the scene in a more epic fashion. I mean, that's just incredible. <laughs> I think that's what it takes to make it. <laughs> We're, so you were in first place. Yeah, I know what's about to happen. <laughs> <laughs> Are you getting yulied? Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. Oh, man. This is before man. I knew... 
quite how hard this course was before. Yeah, before it all. And that's uh, Dave Desert Dog Felberg, correct? Oh, that's yeah. Desert Dog. He was living yeah. in, in Arizona at the time, shredding shots. That's a nice one right there, up around the corner. Oh, MJ, here we go. I think he's only been on lead cards at the <laughs> IDGC. Yeah. Oh, that's a bit of a shanky shanks. But, uh, Paul, you've gotten up and down from about 30 feet worse than that, so I'm... It's yeah, not okay. yeah. Put the forehand roller counter up. Forehand roller, that's <laughs> one. I, I bet we're going to get a couple more. That looked pretty oh, dang decent. Yeah, I think my strategy is just never lay up at this course. It's just no matter what position, just go for it. doesn't work try out that. clearly, but... I hate kidding you. <laughs> that was incredible. That was nice. I'm still out. This is that's no, it's, it's cut it, together. I, I, it's cut together yeah, for highlights. That makes sense. I was like, man, I was all over the place. Yeah, I've got I, that same shirt. Was so bad, we didn't even watch it again. <laughs> <laughs> this is when this used to be hole two, and this is now like hole eight or that's something. Nice, seven. That's or a something. nice kick for a shot going straight down the fairway. Oh, it's apple pie. That's cherry, oh, cherry pie. pie. That's cherry the old. Pie, yeah. Oh, it still flew, flew good. That's an old wow. orc. That was that was two orcs in a row right there. You would only bring that disc out like four times a year. Yeah, it was and a wood, wood specialist. I still have it somewhere. i got to break it out one of these days. That was an Augusta special disc for sure. If that was one yeah. out. Here in Vibram, I knew that Nate was yep. bringing cherry pie out. Really? I'm going to make something? No, of course not. <laughs> <laughs> See, I have a different strategy. Mine is uh, just lay it up, uh, even on accident sometimes. On this course, this oh, looks so good. If I know anything, this is short. No, it's yeah. okay. It's a little pinched off, right? That hole, this hole is, it's so hard to land in a place that will make you happy. But I here, when this tee pad was here, you could throw a sidearm turnover and get down the hill. When they moved the tee pad oh, back. Oh, that's how you do it. Yeah. That's perfect. Wow. No, you're right, Jeremy. Yeah, it's, it, moving it back changed it a lot. So, so much. And that's what they did to this course. This course is already so difficult in this layout. And then a few years back, they made like six holes 10% to 20% harder. It was crazy. Yeah, I don't, I'm curious if I'll ever play this course again. I don't, I don't know any plans. Yeah, yeah, once we did away with the uh, National Tour finale. And Nate made a stink oh. about it enough years in a row. <laughs> that was yeah. ugly, but it got in. Oh, is that your beaver? That's is that your beaver outfit or is that red? It's red. Okay, so you have one just like it, in orange, correct? Uh, I don't think so. That that hmm. one's kind of red with gray. I, I, don't, I haven't had that shirt for a couple years. I mean, but I remember it being red with kind of gray and black. Oh yeah, yeah. Look at this bomb. Why why not forehand <laughs> here, Paul? Do you go forehand um, ever on this hole? No, I like the ability to have it flex out at the end and kind of hyzer back towards the fairway. Forehand, I feel like it dives into the woods on the right. Um, okay. But that might that might change now if we were to go back and play. Okay. Because your forehand's better than it was or because just the disc's uh, different from, the, from Innova the disc. to Discraft? I'd probably just throw a zone instead of having a, wow. a driver hyzer into yeah. the woods. Oh, another Dave appearance. Yeah, Dave. How many different nicknames do you have this round? Oh, like two or three, I think. Two or three. <laughs> All right, so we got we got Desert Dog, and then what else do you call him? Diamondback. Diamondback. Of course, Diamondback Just Dave. kind of desert, a desert theme for sure. <laughs> and this is just me not even knowing what to do on this hole. Still don't know. It's been five years. Still don't know. I just do that every time, <laughs> and then I do a roller. <laughs> and then I try to figure out, uh, you know, like a jump putt up kind of close and see what I can do. But yeah, that hole, so hard. And then yeah, they I, brought the basket back. It's just like made it even harder again. Yeah, I remember our highlights from this tournament was more so just spike ball and being in the lake. Yeah, that was fun. That was a lot more fun <laughs> than what's going on right here. Who okay, are you guys playing spike ball with? Up close. Try to lay this up. There we go. <laughs> That's in there. I'll be hitting that putt. Yeah, who was in your spike ball crew? 
All right, someone we knew we could beat, make ourselves feel better. <laughs> I feel like this is the first time I met like uh, Colin Forehand mm-hmm. and like maybe Kobe, people like that. I don't know that oh, I met yeah, those guys. There. Those dudes are serious about some spike ball. Yeah. Yeah, we caught him early okay. in the first. One tree to beat, didn't beat it. No. It's, nice. it's so confusing seeing uh, these holes in a different order right now. Yeah, it, it, it's hard now. to remember that it was so different before. Yeah. This is Nate's favorite sidearm hole. Oh yeah, this is the tree. Yep. Oh okay, I've I've been hearing talks about this tree. Well, the basket's shorter here, so hitting the tree probably isn't such a big deal at this at this time. See if I hit it anyway. You gotta hit it, right? Looks good. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. He dog command. That's amazing. And I actually had no idea you did that. That's just. Oh, that was big. Wow. Diamond back. Huge Why's... putt. He's he's big putt, Dave. <laughs> wow. I'm I'm glad they're not showing score graphics. Like with Yuli, you could see how far he was slipping. I'm sure I'm ten back by now. <laughs> But, you, but nobody really knows. Yeah, I think I scored four shades of orange, too, on this outfit. <laughs> that is a thing. crush. It's too crushed. I hate that part of the hole. That's such a good drive, and you get up there, and you're like, oh, too good. <laughs> this too is, again, far. just a guy just trying to hold on with his claws, just knowing that he's throwing the wrong shot, but doing it anyway. Oh, gosh. <laughs> yeah. Oh, it just man. goes complete 90 degree left, and you're going forehand. Let me get a roller. Oh, didn't work. Oh, oh, no. Set up a chance for another roller, maybe. No, if, I might be f- trying to flex that. If you save par from here... No you, chance. Or it's a five, back. huh? It's a five. Yeah, yeah it's a five. You got to be on oh, yeah, back and roller from there. I got a chance. That is wow. so pretty. Wow. How do you do that with a backhand? Is that his second or was that his third shot? I'm guessing third. Yeah, third. That's still sick, though. How'd you get there? That was where I was after the after the flex. But yeah, we don't need to okay. talk about that hole anymore. I mean, let's do something else. <laughs> these holes I really didn't like. There you go, swimming. Yeah, yeah that red flag before it crossed the line. Old what turkey was this gulch. called turkey gulch. Yeah. yeah, that's right. These holes were not fun. You know, really? actually, the one I I've always gotten my butt kicked at at Jackson, but the one part about the course that kind of brought me back into the mix would be turkey gulch for some reason it, it just never it never really attacked me the way that it hurt everyone else and that's for par right that's sick yeah but uh oh my gosh you i i mean every time you play you're seeing one person in your group on each of these three holes get a heartbreaking roll away or a great tee oh, shot no. <laughs> what is this guy even doing oh that's my commentary what is this guy even doing <laughs> <laughs> there he is. I think that's the picture you used on our McBeast challenge disc. Oh, there it is. <laughs> See, this is where it started. This is where, it's the same shirt. Why are trees? <laughs> oh, that's before that I even is... knew. You know, that was that was the beginning of it all. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>